Hello everyone! Welcome back to my Let's Play of Dark Souls 3 Crossbow Edition. Or Twin Crossbows, or whatever I meant to end up calling this. It's probably gonna end up with a weird name. Doesn't matter though. Light the bonfire. Hopefully we won't have anything quite as embarrassing as me losing to the first boss of the game multiple times. But, you know, I... I can foresee a lot of difficulties, because this is a challenge run after all, but nothing quite like that. I didn't think it would be quite as bad as that, just to kill Vault. Or whatever his name is. But if I had thought about it for, like I did, I was kind of uh, hesitant about that boss in the first place. Still, now that we've actually cleared that boss, the game should open up quite a bit. The further you get in the game, the more options you have to mitigate certain uh, problems. And that's still true even with a crossbow build. We should be able to upgrade our... Uh, our crossbows a bit more and hopefully get better uh, types of ammunition I think in the end it will be a combination of you can get lightning bolts definitely much later on but probably a combination of sniper bolts and heavy bolts at some point in the game for shooting either at range or close up along with just general uh, upgrades to the crossbows I think by the end of it it will do decent amount of damage. I think maybe the Hornet Ring or one of the other rings might actually benefit the crossbow too. If not, there are general uh, damage increase rings that will work. Yep. Good start. Shooting a wall. Oh, trap. Lock-on is not helping me right now. You go down. Okay. Yeah, gotta be careful with dogs. They can be tricky. No, I can't lock on to you because you're not uh, hostile. Is that how that works? <laughs> That's weird. Oh well. Carry on. We'll go get Yol, even though I don't think I'll use him this playthrough. Wonder if I can free aim. No, that was close. Free aiming is tricky though, so. If it's not gonna work, it's not gonna work. I was pretty lucky there. Oops, damn it. I'm having trouble keeping track of which one's loaded. There we go. Firing from the hip. Now, alluring skulls will be very useful in this playthrough, I'm sure. I'm particularly thinking in the Deacons of the Deep fight, they might come in very <laughs> handy. Please, grant. <laughs> Nope, oh, let's talk to you oh, instead. The champion of Ash, as you I can at least give me a gesture. To be, I am, well, perhaps I was what? Yes, yes, yes. Oh, I sh I... We won't dwell on the NPCs too much. Yeah, there should be an item around here. I don't know what it was though. Homewood bones. Yeah, I need those. Might need to go check out the stores soon. Although I would like to get Loretta's bone before I go back the next time. Because then we can trigger Grey Rat's various scenes. I need him to go on his first scavenging expedition as soon as possible, probably. In order to get better ammo. Now, the only other thing I thought about recently was uh, the boss fight with Yorm the Giant is probably going to be 
an exception in the playthrough. Mostly because I don't think... I don't know why I did that. There was no reason to do it. Um, <laughs> letting my mind wander. Uh, I don't, like... It's hard enough killing him with a regular weapon, let alone a crossbow. I think that's a uh, an effort in uh, extreme patience. If I wanted to do something like that, I might I might try it. But if I end up using the storm ruler or having uh, uh, Sigurd kill him for me, that would be that would be okay. If I can pull it off with Sigurd's help and crossbows, I'll consider that a, a, a perfectly acceptable victory. Um, other than that, the only other time when I might have some trouble is with High Lord Walnir. And it's not so much that I don't want to use crossbows on him, it's just that I don't think I can lock on to his weak points. And so if it turns out that uh, I can't just run up to the bracelets and shoot them at point blank range. I may have to two hand the crossbow in that situation just to just to make the whole thing work. I only made that rule about locking on to uh not locking on. I only made that rule about not zooming in in order to make it so that this playthrough wasn't a cheese fest where I would just do this to every enemy, basically. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, by uh, by making a rule that I'm not allowed to do that generally, it means that I actually have to fight people with the crossbows close up, and in situations where I don't necessarily want to be, but it makes it exciting. Otherwise everything becomes a sniper fest and that's not so good. Yeah, this is, uh, this is actually pretty relaxing, this place. Nothing too terrible is going to happen here. But uh, I need to get that burn. Oh. Pew! Pew! These guys aren't exactly very resistant to crossbows. Yep, I can shoot that down fine. <laughs> I can't imagine too many difficulties with this area. Probably be a few, but like nothing. I would have difficulties with this area if I was just playing with a regular weapon anyway. You know, normal sort of difficulties. People getting the drop on you. Screwing up a roll, that kind of thing. <laughs> Most important thing is I'm killing people with fairly low number of bolts, but I'm actually getting a fair number of souls back for them. Although I think I'm using the good bolts when I really shouldn't be. Yeah, let's switch our primaries back to our weaker bolts and see what kind of uh, difference it makes. Yeah, doesn't barely makes any difference. Still takes two shots. I really should make sure the the offhand one is loaded at all times. Just in case I need to use it. For most shots we'll use the primary crossbow. Because it's the most upgraded. This is a bit, uh... <laughs> I don't normally kill everything except the first time, because I want the Ember, but... Not the Ember. At least I don't think it's an Ember, it should be an Estus, Estus Shard. Flask Shard. Talking properly is hard. Anyway. Okay, 
guess you really do have to dodge through that. Oh. Wow, I've suddenly forgotten how to dodge bug spray. That's certainly a weird thing to have happen. Oop, there we go. That was probably one of the easiest fights I've ever had with one of them. <laughs> they just don't, uh... Don't have much to say, like they... They have their own ranged attack, which is... Like, it hit me a couple of times, but... It wasn't exactly threatening to kill me. Normally you have to go in close, and that's where they're really dangerous. At range, it's just... these guys are nothing. I normally have to be pretty careful about how I do this particular spot. Making sure to get the enemies one at a time, and here it's just like, stand over here and just shoot and shoot and shoot until everyone dies. But that's because no one in this area is moving when you get here. Enemies that will chase after you are, of course, a lot different. Oh! Alright. <laughs> the fact that they're interrupted by rolls makes them particularly uh, non threatening. Like, I. I can't see myself being challenged by any enemy outdoors in this area. Yeah, maybe these little Malcolm guys, particularly ones with the blow darts. Because they don't have to get close to any in the first place. Oh! That was more the camera than anything. Oh! Although they're gonna jump. I might be in trouble. Oh! Okay, this is this is a bit more He jumps around so much, that was the problem. <laughs> the guys in cages aren't gonna be any trouble either because they're weak to arrows or uh, thrusting attacks more specifically. Nothing here. It's just an ambush breaker. Okay. I am gonna run out of bolts eventually though. If I keep it up. I definitely don't want to die before I get my next lot of bolts. They're really weak. Nope. Third time's a charm? Nope. Not even then. I think I have to use my other hand. Close. Oh wow, this is hard. Mind you, I did say that I could shoot objects. I'm just being stupid. <laughs> I was doing so well, well up until then, I didn't want to give it up. But there's no real... Why are these boxes always so blue? Give me my sunlight. And some soup. Nom 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 nom. Uh, yep. Sucks to be you. And the real trouble is this guy. Nope, you didn't make it in time. Should have ran faster. <laughs> yes. Yes, this area, I am a god. <laughs> Weirdly, the, uh, the high wall of Lothric was much harder than this. Just destroying things in this area. <laughs> 